Hello everyone and welcome to the Showtonic Showcase with me Owain, me Alison, me Daniel. Hello everyone. Uh, what is the Showtonic Showcase? Well, it's the part of the week where we go through your cards, you've uploaded to the official Tonic Facebook group and we have a bit of a chat and uh, yeah just sort of wind down of the week, wind up to the weekend. Uh, that's kind of what we do, isn't it? We do. We that's do. what we do. So yeah, um, what we got going on? Well, a Tonic HQ. Yeah, it's just kind of just all kit focused at the moment. Um, we've got yeah, kit 19 is out there. Um, you can check out the unboxing. You got one from the UK and on the US if you want to check that out. Uh, me and Ali went through it on Wednesday. If um, if you're interested, any questions about the kit, you can ask us now. Um, you know, it's show Tonic showcase, a bit of a Q and A sort of thing as well. So if you have got any questions. Um, the original name for this show was Ask Tonic Show Tonic. It was, wasn't it? Way that back. was a long time ago. Well, whether it was, it was Tea Time with Tonic was probably the very first uh, incarnation, and then we changed it. But yeah, that, that's what. Um, this is uh, number 100. This is number 100. Wow! Is, uh, show Tonic Showcase. It's been a long time. Welcome to the 100th. Yeah. We've done it. Wow. Centuries up. Wow. Yeah. Hold your bat up. So there we go. Thing we should. Things. I don't. Oh, I can't believe it. I am. Do we get a letter from Come the on, Dan. There's got to be a bit of confetti you can put on there. Do we get a letter from the Queen? Yeah, we do. Brilliant. Wow. What would she I'm just trying to get us up on you. Yeah. And see who's with us. We have got Kim with us, Georgina, uh, Sue Hare, Sarah, Lou Bamforth joined us, Mary and Amanda Davis so far. Hello. Or Rashmi, Cal and Joan. You uh, crept in there, Joan. There you go. So, uh... Yeah, thank you everyone. Thank you for joining for on the show, Tonic Showcase. A hundred shows. Tonic Live is in the hundred and whatevers. But uh, yeah. Do you know, I was thinking that the other day. We're nearly three years on Tonic Live. Three that years. That is unbelievable. I know. Oh, well. We've had Not. beards. We have enough beards. <laughs> they're growing they've back. Been, they're growing back. We've been. We've, it's been a journey. Um, but that means a hundred shows. A hundred. Some shows we did themes, some shows we've done other stuff, like bits and pieces back and forth. And, uh, we've yeah. had fancy dress. We've we? done fancy dress, we did a Harry Potter, we've done a sport tea theme, tea party. Oh, we do, we've done a lot. We have, we certainly have. So, Amanda says, congratulations, 100. 100, <laughs> thank you very much. Marie's had her kit 18 delivered five minutes ago. Yes. Ready for the weekend, Marie. You can Marie. open it and unpack it as you watch. So, um, yeah, well, what we usually do on the show, yeah, we go through the cards. Um, I'm going to announce the winner of the survey competition at the end of the show as well. Um, so, yeah, well done, everyone who entered that. Um, yeah, it, the, the survey, yeah, again, thank you for all your suggestions and everything that you've put there. Um, some awesome ones, just, yeah, thanks a lot, really. And, uh, yeah, that's it. So, Dan will get the cards ready. Oh, wait, oh, he's doing the celebration stuff. For five. Anyway, what are you guys up to? What have you got planned for this weekend? Where are you and what have you got planned? Let us know on the comments. Joan says, afternoon all, got my new dies today and can start making my boxes. New die day. That's are these your Pentagon boxes, Joan? I'm assuming that's what they are. They must, they must be. They must I think be. we're going to see an awful lot of them coming up in the next few I weeks. Think they, I think we will. Sharon's got the coffees in. Thank you, Sharon. Well done, Sharon. And Lou says congratulations on your 100th as well. Thank you all very, very much. Brilliant. As does Sabine. She says, wow, 100. I know. We're Sabine. very old. Sabine, you've been here for a lot of them. You've seen, yes, you have. You've watched so many hours. There you go. Go on. And if you didn't know already, it's 100 Showtonic Showcases.
Oh, I'm just gone. They've missed the winner. No they, audio. They, they, they did actually. So there you go. Are we back? We're back now. Did you get the winner? <laughs> no. Right, okay. Do it again. The winner. The confetti went in the microphone. And then... oh, oh, no! There we go. Technical difficulties. The winner of 2019's Tony Craft Kit survey go on, was it. Victoria Willem. Congratulations, Victoria. Well done, Victoria. There you go. Well done. As I said, Lots of good I'm not sure whether you're in the US or the UK or outside of that, but either way, you'll either get £100 worth of vouchers for the Craft Kit store or uh, $150 for the USA store. So it's up to you wherever you're from. Uh, we'll sort all that out for you, but well done, everyone who entered. Excellent. Loads and loads of responses. Brilliant. Right, this still... Oh, back now. Yeah, we should be back. There we are. They did say that when the confetti arrived, the sound went. Yeah, that was me. Confetti. <laughs> that makes sense. Um, We're okay, yes, though. Good, right, so, Dan, start the cards, start please. Start the cards. Start rolling. Start, start the cards, cards please. We'll get confetti all the time. <laughs> um, yeah, all day. All day, really. With what we got first. We're on a magic theme today it's a, as well. Yeah, magic, mystical, sort of... To cheer you up. I think it was a she, cheer up Sarah. So, yeah, I hope you're Aww. feeling happy, Sarah, today. Um, so, yeah, uh, first one from Stacey Lowther. Uh, love this uh, jasmine dye. Suitable for adults and teenagers. Suitable for everyone. It certainly is. I think she's a beautiful, beautiful little image. I love her little face. I think she is just stunning. And the flowers in her hair, she reminds me very much of you know, like all the, the festivals and things that are going to come up now in the summer and the spring. That's what she reminds me of. Yeah, it is. Yeah, you're going to see, you see those. These were, yeah, the boho beauties these were. So, yeah, you do have that bohemian look. Definitely. Um, kind of casual cards. Really nice, Stacey. But, yeah, love the shine and stuff. She looks very magical there. So, brilliant. Well done, Stacey. Justine has just asked me, has a parcel arrived today? And it has arrived, Justine. It is absolutely beautiful. And I've forgotten to bring it down with me. What was the parcel? I forgot to bring it. It's upstairs. No. <laughs> I will bring it down next week now and I will show everyone. It is absolutely stunning, <laughs> Justine. And I'm not telling the boys till I bring oh, it down. All right, okay. <laughs> we'll, we'll, we'll wait till but next week. But thank you very, very much. Thank it you. It is beautiful. Justine. Yeah, thank you very much. Even though I haven't seen it. Unless it's a big I hate Dan and blow <laughs> wine card. <laughs> no, it's not at all. It's Making a me out like a mug. Thank you, guest. Um, Stacey, next up, a lovely sort of blue colours, and that's it. You can change it up, especially with those shimmer powders. Yeah. Change up the feel of the card. You can have lots of different stuff going on. Uh, the congratulations was for Megan. It was 100 uh, show tonic showcases, so 100 on our, of our Friday show. Oh, so yes. thank you, everyone. Um, Mwah, Justine. <laughs> Uh, Stacey, yeah, love that card. Thank you, Stace. That's gorgeous. Next up. Oh, we got oh Lily. Oh. It's a, uh, yeah, what well, lovely card this using the kit. This is our last kit. Um, my card made with kit 18, I used distress inks for the background of the dye, uh, and the dyes, paper, stamp and drop from my kit. Oh, looking awesome. Stunning. Lovely Absolutely on the stunning. Side. Love, love, love these dyes. I just think there's so many ways you can put them together. They're all individual little strips, but you can just mix and match and make them into whatever you want to. Toby said, where's the parcel, Ali? You'll run it down. Oh, Tob, it's on my desk. It's not in the parcel. It's on my desk. I don't want to say what it is. <laughs> don't go in a secret drawer. It's not in my drawer. <laughs> right, where my desk is, it's on the right-hand corner of my desk. Stay out of the drawer, Toby. And Don't go no, in that drawer. There's note excited. <laughs> Don't go in that drawer. Um, <laughs> Lily, I, I, yeah, well, Toby will be on his way down here now, I'm sure. Um, yeah, I, lo I love the way you're done with the sentiment. It's always like a front oh, door. Are we frozen? Gate. Have we frozen? Mine froze too. Frozen, let it go. Have we frozen? No, I, th I think we're okay on YouTube, but is it just Facebook? I don't know. I don't know. Should we I don't know. Should we have a little... That's a different face than what I was doing before, so maybe. <laughs> yeah. There we are, we're all right now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Lily, oh, I, I love that. Well we done, every one of you who've got your kids. I uh, hope you're enjoying them. Um, yeah, I hope, hope, you, hope you're enjoying oh. them. Oh, I think we're okay. It's again. okay, it's okay. 
it's okay. No, it's okay now, says Justine. You can watch us on YouTube as well. So when we're talking about two different comments and maybe you don't see them, um, yeah, we're live on Facebook, the Tonic Studios Facebook page, and on uh, the Tonic Studios YouTube channel. So if you want to go over there, you can do. It's pretty much the same. It's pretty much the same. We're all the uh, same. Okay. It's all the same. Uh, but lovely Lily, really like that, that one. That is gorgeous. Oh, Jolie. cutie Jolie. So happy I've had time to do uh, that card. The background is done with the Nouveau Mica Mist, Nebula Blue, the sand with Ivory Sand, Nouveau Glitter, and all the colouring with Nouveau Markers. It's awesome. That is fantastic. I do love a little cider card. It's brilliant. I think they are fantastic. Such a cool idea. Background is awesome, and it's so... Just really well done, Jolie. Awesome. The left. Okay. As I'm, that's, <laughs> that one. That's it. That one there? Yeah. Okay, cool. <laughs> Thank you very much. Doesn't even Thank want his arms job. to be on the show. Thank you. <laughs> there we are. This was the little gift. I thought it was beautiful. And this is going to go on the wall in my, in my office. That is awesome. It's stunning, isn't it? I love yeah. all the techniques you put into it. How is it, like, laminated? What? I think that's embossing powder. I think it's triple embossed. It is just so stunning. Good. That effect, brilliant. And it's like, what is it? What's it cut into? What triple this card? Is, yeah, all card layered together. Justine, brilliant. We've got little rings that have come from um, from the kit, from the memory book yeah. kit. And Justine's favourite was the butterfly. So it couldn't have been more appropriate, Justine. It is absolutely stunning. It's quite, You've yeah. done a little bit of colouring Quality. under the wings. How do they do that? Is it shimmer powders on the back? No, I think she's coloured it. I think. Oh, how do you do the dots? Are they just like, you know, because they, they, they are like, it's really spacey, like the... Is it, or is it, it a cardstock? It could be cardstock. It really does look Justine, you're going to have to tell us Justine, now. Justine, Glossy accents on the thanks. Have you coloured the background, Justine, or is it from um, from your inks? Let us let us know. Um, but yeah, Jolie, this card is awesome. So uh, mm. that and Justine, brilliant. Thank you so much for that. That is brilliant. I love the thank you so much. It. It's stunning, That's, stunning, brilliant. Um, yeah, and love that love that slider. Yeah, check out Jolie's blog if you got the thing at the bottom there. It's an awesome blog. I've seen some of the bits of your work. Really quality stuff. So yeah, go check that out. But yeah, well done, Julie. Awesome. Next up, Dan. As a paper pad by Altenew. Yeah, that's cool. Just perfect. Absolutely stunning paper. Neither. Next up, together we are a magic. Nouveau drops give a magic effect uh, and cards and your flowers. Designed this magical card with Prima Martian Wild and Free paper pack. Use my handmade flowers and gold heat emboss. I love your style, Neither. Beautiful. It's love it. I love that, that sort of decoupage mixed elegant. media thing that you got going on with your cards i love the color of it and like we've said before there's so many different styles of this mixed media sort of thing going it on it is it is it's it's lush you go from your very very pretties to your grunge and everything that comes in between and that's it i think need is from i think from karachi i think it's pakistan isn't it so uh, yeah it's good to see we've got crafters yeah yeah o over there in pakistan too well, so. craft i think is one knits the world together whether it be a local craft to your town or village or whatever or whether it be something that is worldwide because you see a lot of crafts that are just done in certain places i think like if yeah if you take back craft like as a word like what does it mean kind of to craft it's you know taking time to create something yourself so whether yeah. it be a you know in japan and some those craftsmen make those like samurai swords and things like yeah. that and you take time and care over making something yourself that you enjoy that can be anything that can be pottery that can yeah. be yeah you know, wherever you're from like it could be something that you do and that is craft and that is what what goes across painting or the you know the arts that you know but if you spend time yourself making it how you want it then that's craft i guess exactly i mean it would have been years ago what was available locally in your area yeah so if you were somewhere that's got very clay soil then that's that would allegedly yeah be yeah that would, yeah that's it yeah you do yeah, you do what you can, you know, and craft. You see people who do crop circles and stuff like yeah. that, you know, and you see them on the side yeah. of mountains and things. And you see... Um, well, then you've got the corn dollies and things where you've dollies, got the, yeah. the, um, the crops, whatever they are, wheat, straw, whichever. Yeah, oh, wood, <coughs> wood craft and things, you know, and even, you know, cookery and things like that go into... They're kind of on the edge of it mm. and things like that as well. It's all that creating yourself and doing something 
which isn't necessarily off a shelf. You're you're creating something yourself. So I think it's good to get in touch with that and uh, yeah and enjoy it. So well done, Need. I, I really like that. I really like that card. Oh, David said he made a card and it was awesome, but when I went to photograph it, it disappeared. Like magic. Like magic, wow. David. David, that is well such a done. shame. Well that is done. such a shame. Hopefully it'll turn up somewhere yeah, you're not expecting it, it. Yeah, exactly. Um, Nita said she'll, she'll post details of pictures in, in comment area. Oh, brilliant. Yeah, check it out. Uh, check it out in, it's in, the, in the post, I think. Next up, Mary. Um, I coated the edge of the base card with Peony Pink Nouveau um, and used beautiful Supernova Dream Drops around the edge. There's a lovely shine to the cards, but it doesn't show up very well in the photos. Oh, it does show. I can see a sheen a there. Shine on the drops as well. It's stunning. I love it, and it looks awesome that you've got that layer, that bit of depth to it on the, and she acts like a silhouette. Then. She does. She does. I love that little fairy. I think she just fits in with everything. What was she from? I don't. I can't she was a fairy range that we did. Um, oh gosh, we've, maybe two years ago, maybe had, even longer. Sometimes we just chuck a fairy into a. Sometimes there'll, there'll be like a launch where you you have an extra bit which is like a fairy, like the. What have we she seen was recently? with, um, I can't think of the names of them. We had, was it Brina? What, Fairy Reflections? No, I think it was before Fairy Reflections. I know, one, and there was a wand and stuff as well. There was a wand in there, And a yeah. little sprig flower thing. Yeah, yeah there was I, a little I, Lily I, of the Valley. I do remember, yeah. Um, oh, Sandrine says, bonjour, Ali and Owai. Bonjour, Sandrine. I'm back doing my French again now. Um, je passe le week-end, visite... Paris. Ooh, look I spent the weekend visiting Paris. Was it nice? Um, wait a sec. Sete très agréable. Oh, well done. <laughs> it was well lovely. Well done. <laughs> That's the best sentence I've ever done. <laughs> under, under pressure there. Uh, Mary, I love that. It's beautiful, Magnifique. Mary. Um, Lily, uh, next up again. Oh, what we got here? Like, this is oh, another box, one. First of all. No, this is the kit again. These are the dies that were present in the kit. I think it, it's got like a. And that's the paper. These are the dreaming colour papers. Oh, I like it. That's it. Like think of the, the you know interesting ways that you can do them. Like using them like a gate, using them like you could have that open out. Yeah. You could do, and you got using that banner bit as well. Exactly. Really, really cool. And then you've got the stamping on the bottom then with the sentiment. Yeah. Beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. Really like it, Lily. Awesome cards. I'm glad you're enjoying the kits as well. Um, Sabine, my children, uh, I'm looking after made them. Just a little help was needed. Oh, lovely colours. Sabine says you, ooh la la. Ooh la la, Sabine. You. Yeah, you like it? You like it? She's obviously liking your bit of French. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm spending a bit more time on it. I'm doing 10 minutes a day. And, and I... Yeah. Sandrine cool, says yeah. your French is good, are I? Mm, merci. <laughs> 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 um, so yeah, so be nice. I love the the colour combo. I love combos. the colours you've used there, Sandrine. She says, As Sabine, uh, Sabine, sorry. she says the children I'm looking after made them. Um, oh. oh I, I need to do some German for you now, Sabine, but I don't know. That's a good. <laughs> Finn, who came to, to to stay, he'd be able to say something. Oh, he was lovely. He was nice, funny. Sabine, awesome, love it. Um, next up, Anders Carlson. Hi, Charlene. She's just joined us now as well. Oh, this, right? This is Marie's husband. She oh says, wow! It was nice uh, to see you craft in and that you had fun. Maybe there will be more. So Anders gave it a go. And I said, "What a good, what a great start." That's fantastic, Anders. If you're watching, you've got the bug, you've got the talent. That's very ingenious for some, and, and I'm assuming Anders is not um, a normal, you know, a regular crafter, I mean. Yeah, yeah. But he's got some fabulous techniques Good there. some techniques, isn't it? I, I, I think Marie was just... Uh, I think you've been guiding Marie. I think Marie. you've been backseat crafting there uh, <laughs> over, <Definitely. laughs> over the shoulder. But yeah, Marie, br brilliant card, Anders. Sorry, I shouldn't be giving Marie the credit there. Anders, brilliant card, well done. Uh, and thank you for for joining in. Yeah, hope you will you'll join us I in a few more weeks. I love that. I'm assuming that's your Valentine's card. Yeah, I, that must be it. That it's gotta be. be it. It's gotta be. If it's not, then it really it should needs, be. It should be. Um, you need a nice little message in there. Um, Joan says she's not done any crafting for a while since having her knee done, um, but she's not too bad apart from 
oh i can open these today normally i can't open the end of the message um she keeps falling down she's got a bad ankle and she's getting back to crafting but she's missed our show oh joan yeah i've seen you anyway i hope you're all right um i'm gonna keep going down oh okay yeah would you look after yourself joan and hopefully uh, your knee and your ankles are looking all right keep up those exercises joan and i'm sure it'll strengthen itself then that's it and happy crafting and happy crafting exactly um yeah. find that happy bug again that's it uh next up dan uh gainer yes a fairy these a fairy silhouette or something these were the semi dies that came out probably about mm, maybe years five years ago i'm thinking they were fairly new when i started maybe just over five years actually yeah. i'm thinking they, it's a bit longer i came to the like i came to the show and i and i owed sabine like a like a prize for this um for something and i was like i got out the dot and drops i was like i got it from there the office and i was like oh there you go and she goes oh i'm sorry i've already got them and uh, i was like oh no and then she goes oh well i looked at the stall and i was like oh well yeah, you can have some from here you know that could be a prize and she's like i already have all of this oh. so i was like and she's like could you find me something like old or try and find in the back catalog and well i don't know like the, i know this was the kind of thing that you want because you're a collector sabine yeah and this would have blown your mind if i ever find something like this then you maybe can get first dibs because uh yeah but gainer you got a classic there and they still you know they're still so appropriate today she's again she's such a little cutie whether it be for your youngsters or your older ladies, we all like a little bit of magic in our lives. That's it. It's a yeah, it's a quick uh, a quick card as well. You just lay it over something. You have got a nice silhouette to come through the back there. But you can you know you can make it as detailed as as you want. Gainer, awesome. Well and done. again, fabulous for your shimmer powders and your spray backgrounds and things. That's the thing. Like some of our older dyes, they they were before obviously we did shimmer powders yeah. and things like that. So like they would have gone perfect with them. They were they were ahead of their time definitely they were ahead of their time i've often looked at dyes that we did way back and thought yes they would go yeah, they, they would, would fit in very very well now so that yeah that's it so new products sometimes you know give older products uh, a new lease of life as it were um next up dan anya's joined us as well hi anya hi anya um yeah again and yeah lovely again and that that card looks brilliant on it. You love that holograph. It's good, isn't it? Yeah, it's kind of, of you can't stare at it for too long, but it is uh, it is good before it. The pictures makes you, of it look <laughs> amazing. You tripping out. <laughs> they do, do, don't they? <laughs> when you see the rainbow going across the picture, I think it looks pretty special. Yeah, yeah. It's all, yeah well brilliant. done, Gainer. Yeah, awesome, Gainer. Well done, Justine. Next up. Oh, Sabine says, inform me first, please, because I keep collecting from eBay. Wow, well, I'll, I'll have to, I'll see if I find anything. I don't have anything of age, really, for a while. Like, but Oh, I'll, I don't know whether I've got anything upstairs. Unless Ali's got it. But if I'm in the warehouse sometime and there's don't a... Don't think I've got any of And I, I bang against, like, a hollow compartment, then it goes... And I'll go... And then I'll push the door. <laughs> like, I'll pull the, um, the lamp. And then the stairs go down. And then he'll go and Dan's in his coffin. Yeah. Down there. <laughs> I go, is this where you're sleeping, Dan? Um, then maybe we'll have an old die there or something in, in the in the vaults. Um, oh, Charlene says she keeps losing us. It's like Groundhog Day. T try YouTube if you're struggling on Facebook. Uh, jump over to yeah, youtube.com slash Tonic Studios. I think it's Tonic Studios UK, I think. Slash live, I think. Slash live. So, yeah, but if you, if you type in Tonic Studios YouTube, you'll find us. Um, it's like ground up today. Every time I see you, I get the post up exactly the same. Oh well. <laughs> That's try us on YouTube. Try us on YouTube. An example: um, a remake uh, of a card I made last year for some recipient, but a frame project. Tonic card is a wee bit of stencils and uh, oxides used. Oh, a lovely mod. I think that's lovely. Mod card. I really card, think that's lovely. Yeah, Quadrophenia card. Definitely. Awesome. Yeah. Yeah, oh, brilliant. There's loads of people who are into kind of, you know, that kind of stuff. So, yeah, you could... It'll be the mods and rockers it'll again. It'll be the mods no. and rockers. You want to start that again. <laughs> but, but the, you know, like, if you know there's like a niche or something that people will enjoy, if you are making your stuff to sell, I, I'm only talking from the perspective of a buyer maybe now, you know that there's an, a niche taste that people will like. Mm. Try and find that little niche out there. So if you know that there's like people like wall art for... I don't know anything that they may like. They may like 
But we have the Elvis festival here. Yeah, say, say it's Elvis. And that's local to us. Say it's Elvis, but some Elvis fan may go on eBay and type in Elvis poster or mm. warframe. And you may have the perfect piece of art for them, or you might have the perfect card or I something. Mean, if you can draw, yeah, draw your Elvis. You can make prints from that Elvis, then put them onto your cards. And and, and that's it with fairies and things like that, or magic sort of stuff. You can do like someone typing in fairy mobile and things like that. Yours is going to be the thing that people are looking for then. So that's just finding that maybe there's a niche that you do which nobody else. You're mm. into something that nobody else is into. And then you think nobody, but it's a global, you know, it's a global yeah. world. You know, there's there's ways to find, you know, people find each other now. Well, we've all found each other with craft. That's right. So why not that? So I mean, I've made the most amazing friends through craft. And they've not just been in this country. They've been in other countries as well. Yeah. People I would, you know, I would never have met otherwise. Um, Sarah says, uh, oh, Tonic, will you please give us a topic next Friday so it gives us more time to create something? All right, then, all right. What should we pick? I, I, on the topic of that, maybe it's like your passion, okay? So something like that you, something individual to you, all right, that the card okay. represents. Okay. So maybe it's like, maybe you love dogs, Sarah. Maybe you do. And if you do, then you can, uh, you know, make that card to incorporate that. Or maybe you're into... I don't know, maybe you're into motorbikes, maybe you're into cars, gardening. maybe you're into gardening. Do something that's special to you, which you've got a little bit of something to talk about uh, on there. Include it in the comments why this card sums up you. So represent yourself, a bit of yourself in the cards, all right? So that can be the theme for this week. It could be where you're from. It could, yeah. be, it could be a hobby that you have, something like that. Maybe cut out, you know, cut something out from a magazine, stick it on, whatever it is. Um, and we'll have some fun next Friday with that as well. Justine says it was for her brother. Ah, oh, brilliant. Who loves, his, who loves Lambretta scooters. This is the closest he gets to having <laughs> no, them. No. He might Aww. one day. He might one day. My father used to ride a scooter. A Lambretta one? I think it may well have been, actually. It's a, it's a bit like a Lambretta. I guess it's an Italian brand. But it's, it's kind of, I guess, scooters. It's, like, it's kind of a British th- yeah. thing. But then you've got that Italian, because they like the Vespers or yeah. scooters, don't they? So. Oh, but... I think it's called it's a Vespa, Vespa, yeah. yeah it's Vespa, it's for a while. Oh, it may yeah. have been a Vespa. What's the link now? there? You know, the Vespa is the one with like, the big kind of like almost like shield at the front. Oh, you know, okay. I yeah. think it may have been that one. Mm. What's the Lambretta then? I don't know. <laughs> Lambretta is the make, I think. No. So, yeah, like, so what they, do they look like? I thought all scooters look the I same. I think they look the same. Oh. Come on. All scooters look the Come same. Come on, Justine, all tell us. That's like saying all dyes look the same. You enraged all the people who love that I know, but a car is four wheels and an engine to me, so, you know. <laughs> you, you you see, like, the make, like, they're going, that'll upset people as well. I know we will. You, you, you see, <laughs> you, you see the, ma- the makes, like, so you'll see, like, Lambretta tops, and you see, you know, like, Ben Sherman, mm. you'll see that, those kind of things, which are kind of, like, yeah, that's British, yeah. British bands, sort of, not bands, British brands. Like that? Yeah. I never <laughs> saw my father's what? scooters. What do you mean, like that? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I mean, like, like there's, like, Italian makes and there's yeah, British yeah. makes. I'm not sure what the British makes are. I don't know. Justine on I Montana's. wouldn't have a clue. Lucinda, yeah, mods and rockers. That's right. Um, next up, Justine, yeah, a birthday card for my great aunt's 99th birthday. 99 is inside, tonic person card, and Nouveau drops use. Oh, happy birthday for your, for your aunt's 99th. Awesome, but she loved that. <laughs> Justine says, no idea. It's not chocolate or handbags. That sounds good to me, Justine. <laughs> All chocolate and handbags look and taste the same. No, right. they don't. How is that? No. How is that for you, Justine? Oh, no. There you go. Um, lovely colouring. Love this, Justine. Beautiful colouring and a lovely bit of pearlescent card so there. For a, for a great aunt's 99th birthday. So I mean, that, what an achievement. To what get to 99 is amazing. Brilliant. Absolutely amazing. Well done. Um, Justine next up. Justine. You felt a busy week, Justine. The, the pyramid can... method was introduced. It, it, your namesake, and yet you've put in three cards or projects here. <gasps> Shocking. Shocking. She breaks her own rules, but I guess that's what the own that's what all innovators do. They break their own rules. So well done, uh, well done, Justine, on uh, ripping up the rule book <laughs> on this one. Uh, Valentine's card, tonic papers used, and newly purchased at the tonic workshop. 
uh, stitch rectangles from thing. I love that. It it's beautiful. Lush layout. It's very simple but so effective. That's it. Great. It's it's really hard to make a very very good simple card because every bit on that card has to play its part perfectly, and that's what you've done there. That's it. Um, yeah, really nice. Uh, just to Catherine's just said she just a quick hello as I'm teaching tapestry, and have a lovely weekend as she'll catch us later on. Have a fabulous weekend, yeah, Catherine. Have a brilliant weekend, Catherine, and and yeah, I know you're teaching uh, teaching your student well, so yeah. Oh, uh, well done. Enjoy it. It's good to share your knowledge, though. Oh my gosh, my bad, Justine. Don't pretend like you know better than that. You know, you knew what you were doing. You're just trying to push the boundaries. <laughs> trying to push the boundaries. Um, I d Kim says, I don't do name brands. Why advertise a company when you can uh, pay a lot for them? That's exactly what my son says. Uh, yeah, fair, he, won't buy a, he won't buy anything that's got a branded mark on it. It should be. like The cheaper the clothes, the more branding it has on there. Mm. So you pay to not have the branded yeah. on. They could do it the reverse yeah. ends. But you'd end up for really cheap clothes then. You'd like... You know, like cyclists or motorbikes, you just have all the like, brands yes. like, all over it. Um, wow, look at this. Michaela, awesome. I love that. I think How that pretty. Is so pretty. I want to see inside there. I know, there. we got I the want... next. Oh, no, no, Michaela. You... That looks amazing. Look at that. The detail is awesome. And the little vines and the, the grapes, awesome. And your little picket fence around the outside. That is just stunning. So well done, Michaela. Love it. <laughs> Oh, Justine's we... having a good giggle. <laughs> no, no laughing matter, Justine. I don't know why you're laughing. <laughs> you know you shouldn't have done it. Um, next up, this is magical. I love this. This is certainly magical. This is very um, Elsa and Froze. Elsa rather and frozen to me. It is. Isn't that it? could be, you know, the frozen castle. It is. Yeah. Really. Yeah. It, it, it. You can create. You can change any of tonic stuff. The boxes. Anything. Yeah. You can make them the thing that you want. You can make them magical with the lovely papers and toppers and things like that. So yeah, you can do. Yeah, you do some great stuff. I love it. Love it, Mishi. That's beautiful. Yeah. Brilliant. Um, next up. Oh. Marie, awesome. <laughs> Justine says she's like an eight-year-old coming home from school with all my artwork for you to put <laughs> on the fridge. Oh, Justine, bless you. Well, we're only putting two of them on the fridge, Justine. <laughs> the yeah. third one goes in the We've bin. only got a mini fridge this week. <laughs> yeah. It's only a mini fridge. Uh, love this. Class. Love it, Maria. Absolutely love the way you've layered that that, um, that, is that cool, die. That is cool, Like your layouts, I always think awesome. I always say about yours, Marie, like your layouts are great. And how cool, it's almost like a 3D effect. It is, it is. But your colours are just perfectly matching there. That's stunning. Good, isn't it? And the chalk, you've got the chalk there, like sort of <laughs> that, that sort of sentiment. I think it's embossing powder, but it looks, it's perfect. It is, it is. Love that card. Justine says, consider myself told off. There you Hope go. you're still you laughing, have. You Justine. Have. You're forgiven, there you go. Um, yeah. uh, next up, next up uh, Dan? Look at that as well. Wow. Or oh, using the, the paper pack mandalas. Yeah. And our little trumpeter. Is that... For a second, I thought it looks like it's cut through, isn't it? But it's it's a layer that you cut. Like it's a, a layer that's on... It's a layer of vellum, I think. Is it? Yeah. Yeah, because you can see the mandalas behind it. So it's a layer of vellum, coloured vellum over the top. And I think she's cut round the edge of it. So the, that's a frame, yeah. and that's a layer in the inside. Looks really good. It's beautiful. And that's beautiful. A good, yeah, that that sort of. I can't remember his trumpeter solo or something. Is it yeah. Some, yeah. It's, yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, they jazz clubish. It is very. Me it of. is very jazz club. Yeah, Marie, awesome. Well done. And there you go. A bit closer yeah. up then. Yeah. You can see. That's beautiful. Next up, Dan. And again. Uh, Sandrine, um, bonjour. I made uh, my hexa uh, kaleidoscope box with a die set mermaids because mermaids are so magical. No, he, oh, he. Uh, I added some dream drops uh, supernova. Uh, I love these new drops. At some point, I will do the whole bit back and forth between you, Sandrine, in French, right? In, in the, <laughs> by the end of the year, I, I will. But yeah, brilliant. And you can use, you could you easily use that as a card as well. You know, if you want to make that or use your lids and stuff as a card. Um, yeah, it's brilliant and I love great it. use And I love drops. the colours you've used there again. 
and these drops are something special if you haven't seen the dream drops yet you really you really need to and you need to see them up close because the colors are very much like oil on water they're a, they're a unique um design absolutely fantastic like they were almost going to be called like there was a choice of the two names wasn't there there was Dream Drops was one, and the other was Aurora Drops, which was yeah. the other one. So, like the Aurora Borealis, it was going to be that kind of thing. Yeah. But uh, we went with Dream Drops. It was just easier to say, I think. And uh, exactly. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, they, that Aurora ness is still very much in there. Um, I think they're very magical. Oh, Sandrine says she loves Dream Drops. Yeah. Oh, oh, look, you've got the Little Mermaid on the side as well. Lovely. Again, you can make these boxes whatever you want them. Exactly. And then. Love it, Sandrine. Well done. Oh. Next up, Dan, too. This is another cutie. There you go. Yeah, oh, look at that. Wow, Sandrine. And this card, you've uploaded, th well, it's two projects, so I'll allow it. Um, and this card uh, for the children, dreams, and the magic of a unicorn. Wow. Exactly. Yeah. You couldn't get no more magical than a unicorn. Yeah, I love the. The CL there, uh, Sandrine. A sky, oh, look at sky you. in French. And Soleil uh, for the, the sun. And I don't know Cloud, I'm afraid. Uh, but wow. And you certainly don't know Unicorn. I don't know. <laughs> uh, unicorn, I don't know. <laughs> I got a, what's Unicorn in French, Sandrine? Do we just stick with that? Um, lovely little bit. Brilliant. And I think you've done a bit of inking with your clouds. It as is. Well. It's good. It's a cool effect. It's really good. Very good layered effect there, What's that? even though it's flat. I think it's stenciled a little bit, did not it? Yeah, yeah. She, the one at the front is three D'd, but the others are done with ink and. That's it. You just only you would do the back and then you just use that as the front, like sort of. It's a really clever effect. A bit like the, what do we have? Licorne. Gates, garden gate ones, didn't we? Licorne. Licorne. Brilliant. Got Nuage. It. I'm, I think that must be the clouds. Nuage. Yeah. Well, we're, we're learning, aren't we? We are. We're learning. Every day is a school Every day. Every day is a school day. Uh, next up, Dan. Oh, we haven't seen these in a while. Oh, Darryl. little dressables. Uh, awesome. Certainly, again, you fitted the brief perfectly here with our little magician. Brilliant. That lush and that silver card on the back is awesome. Really sort of gilded. That looks really is expensive. from the magazine. Yeah. That's a good How use of it, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. I have to have a double look then to think I know, I know that. Where's it from? Because he was so. Uh, not buried is the right word, but he was so in with all the Christmas stuff at the time. That he was, it's easy just to see it in that light, but you can use it as like sort of a. Yeah, wow, comic yeah. book, whatever you want to use. Magic. Well, the sentiment is you're a star. So that could be throughout the year that you're telling someone you're good, you're clever, you're. You're wow, you know, what you're doing is perfect. Mm, Daryl, love it. Well done, Daryl. David says unicorns do exist. They're just grey in fact and we call them rhinoceros. I think that that's true, <laughs> isn't it, David? You've worked it out there. Uh, Aww. <laughs> Tracy, uh, this hard from my colleague at work's birthday using gleaming line like pearlescent card and cobalt uh, velour satin effect card love on the that drops card. and kit 18. Awesome. I love the corners. Stunning. Corner. Absolutely stunning. But that, that cobalt card just pops. Every time you see it, it just pops off the page. It is. And that's the kind of colour you don't you're not gonna often see in a card. Like no. in a in a card that you buy off a shelf, um, like say you buy in the supermarket, you don't get those colours or the no, quality on the card. You don't. And you know, regardless of the price of the price you pay for the card at the shop, you just don't see that richness to the colours and that's what you get to do with your own cards like you can do that so yeah and it's how you know you personalise those colours to whatever colours the person likes that's it you know when I used to make cards for people like they say can you make a card for so and so right what do they like what's, you know do they have any hobbies what's their favourite colours and that was the first two things I would say yeah I, that's right uh, Tracy <coughs> Yeah, really nice. Oh, and, and how old are they? <laughs> <laughs> I just guess. Um, yeah, and Tracy, there you go. So you can see there's depth to it you as well. You certainly can. Wow. Brilliant. There's a few foam pads there. Which dye is that in the background? Boho Beautiful, I think. Just from a distance, Tracy. <laughs> yeah, it is. It is, isn't it? Uh, well done. Wow. Uh, Tracy, yeah, look at that. Love this is shoe. what she made in the workshop, I think. Is it? Yeah. Oh, awesome. Yeah, this was Jen's workshop. 
and we see in a lot of a lot of the projects that we started in the workshops and if we ran out of time people are finishing them off at they home can take them home in a doggy bag and finish them so we see in some lovely projects again you know look at the depth of that lovely and it's yeah it's got and a lot of the ladies and the gentlemen it was their first time to use Novo. we, d- we did it like a range you know <coughs> like you those that's the uh, sleeve though they were the sleeves, sleeves. yeah we, yeah and we did a range way back it was the guard it's kind of guard and gatey do you know the ones down the front bay yes what were they called um, 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 what were they called then? Bay, like they were kind of like bay window oh, sort of thing. Oh, a window window box. Dice. Window boxes. That was it. Oh, yeah, they had like a front, like a front. Boxes. So yeah, like yeah. that kind of. Yeah. Thing. You can do that with the sleeves if you've got them. You can. You can. There you go. Um, Tracy, yeah, love it. Next up, Dan. And well done for finishing yeah. your card. Well Tracy. done. Well done. Look at this, oh, you've got wow. um, Fantastic Beasts. I made this one a couple of weeks ago and forgot to share. Love your concept cards. Oh, I'm glad you like that. Concept. And that's like, that, nothing more concept than that. Not at all, not at all. This was our sidestepper. I can't remember what they call that little green one in a film. Oh, no, me. You've seen it quite recently, mm. didn't you? So did I, actually. Mm. I've seen Justine's asking, is there a workshop feedback survey coming out? Oh, maybe there could be. Oh, not a bad idea. You never know. If it's negative, though, we don't want to hear it. <laughs> <laughs> well, we, if there's things that you would like us to change, we're not saying we're doing another one, but we're not saying we're not. Yeah. So who knows? What time of year would you like it, for instance? That kind of thing. You know? We'll see. That kind of thing. What things would you like to do on the day? Yeah, that, that could be a good idea. Another survey for you? Another survey for me? Um... Oh, loves a survey. I do love a survey. Um, oh, this is a cutie. What have we got? Jeanette. Sarah says um, it was her first time making flowers too and um, learned so much from Jen. Oh, Jen is Jen. so talented and she loves to share those talents with you as well. She is really clever. She certainly is. Uh, Jeanette, tonic dyes used a Celtic dream and a boreal and radiant Rosselli with hunky dory images as well. What lovely use of top. That is stunning. Then. Absolutely stunning. And this is where we like to see a, a crossover in your craft, where you've used your dyes with other things. Yeah. Because it extends your, you know, if you've bought some card packs with some toppers, it's extended those for you as well by mixing in your plain card so, stock. You know, go in your dye thing, just close your eyes, pick out two, mm-hmm. see, see what you can make. Lucinda yeah. says better weather so she can drive to Wales. Yeah, right. <laughs> <coughs> we, we can't. We definitely can't, we can't guarantee that. Guarantee anywhere that any time of year in Wales, it's usually wet. It's usually raining. But it doesn't always snow in the summer. Um, and a workshop in the summer months, please. Okay. Yeah. Well, it's all noted. Uh, Nida, the next one designed this beautiful shabby chic multi layered card. So I don't have any Tonic Studios dies. I wish to be part of the Tonic Studios team in the future. Well, you now maybe you can be Nida uh, in the future. But yeah, love it and just yeah, love your style, Nida. Awesome. That's beautiful. I love that. Really, really pretty shabby chic uh, as to it. And just, yeah, brilliant card. Well done. Nita. I love your, I love your, um, your layering and everything you put there. It is. I'd, I wonder, I'd like to see, I've got to watch more videos on that. that like, you know, like Marta does and stuff. Yeah. Like, how long do they, does it take to, because you guess you just layer in and build in and see what looks right. Marta and, uses a lot of painting techniques. So obviously she's drying a lot of stuff in between her layers. Because you did a course, didn't you? you I did. did. I did. I did a course. I think you need to dig. You need to. You need to get back into it. There was good stuff you did with the mix. I media. loved that course. Absolutely loved it. You were all about. You, you went into the room after. It's like, oh, have you been on a course, Ali? Because like the whole room was like. I know. These are some I of my mixed media projects. She was just. I loved it. You need to get doing it again. Yeah, I did. Um, a workshop in France, Andrew. Oh. South of France would be nice, wouldn't it? That would be good, wouldn't it? It was hard enough to transport everything down the road, mm-hmm. let alone to maybe, the south of France. Maybe that's a clue why I'm learning French. Maybe that's that's the reason yeah. we need to. I went so to Le Grand Motte the, um, last year in France. Yeah. There so, wasn't a lot going on there. I'm, I'm sorry. Oh, I, don't, I don't want to go back. I'm you're not going Le, Grand, Le Grand Motte. I love France, but Le Grand Motte. It was just it was just off season. There wasn't much going on. Like it wasn't a lot going on. The Grand Mot doesn't really. Strike Le Grand Mot, I know. <laughs> it doesn't sound. No, it, it just was like. I know I don't have the accent, but Le Grand Mot. Le Grand Mot. <laughs> doesn't say it for me. <laughs> we we the boys like we just, 
like we went a football team we went there and we have we have a football it's a tournament for an, a company i worked for years and years ago and we still go and we still have a team like wales team go there but it's kind of out of the town so often we end up in a place which is like it's not your so it's near montpellier but not right. not near enough really yeah. <laughs> it, it, it was like 30 40 minutes out like outside there so then we were just going there and we turned up on the day. We we're like, oh, can't wait to go, right? <laughs> can't wait to get out because we wanted to have a few drinks and things. But like, it was all just quiet, but like oh, little cafes no. along the thing. And all the shops were shut at like four. I don't know whether that's just a French thing anyway. But like, you couldn't buy it. It was just like, <laughs> oh, we, we had a good time in, in the end. But it was all kind of, it was just kind of like an art deco so kind of old thing. it wasn't a grand, thing. it was a petite mot then. No, le, pe- <laughs> le petit mot. It, it, it was not, like, it, it was just a, um, I don't know how to describe it. It was like loads of art deco design thing. It was, oh, wow. I'll have to show you a picture. It's kind of, it was just bizarre sort of experience. Maybe so. Wow. Maybe I can tell. Maybe Sadine, you can tell. Uh, you can tell the Grand Mot. Um, yeah. Uh, next up, Lucinda, Valentine's card for my boyfriend. He has the magic key to my heart. Uh, <laughs> She's got the uh, sick face. Oh, just uh, Lucinda, you can't do that. He does make me a better person, though. Oh well, that, that's, oh, it. that's what the. That's um, his role in life. That's what the other half's meant to do. Exactly. Help you improve. And a beautiful Valentine's card as well. That's it. Brilliant. I love that, Lucinda. Well done. Next up, Dan. Ricky. Ah, oh, yes. I haven't seen that as well. That's wow. Original waterfall. I was that the hearts? Yeah. Or was that the ones that went on the show? No, that was what went on oh, the show. Was. Yeah. Brilliant. That, that, that is one. done then. And that's clearly a wedding card that you've made. If you haven't seen a waterfall one, it's like they, we haven't seen them for a little while. It's the first time we've seen No, we haven't. Yeah, just we? pull them. They've got like a mechanism and it just And, and they all flip back. around. And you can lovely little lovely little style of card, I think. I think, yeah, really cool. Rick. Lots of little secret bits you can write in. Like it, Ricky. Uh, next up is Lou, uh, and it is, I can't show the actual cards yet, but these are some of the items I'm using. I will show the cards next week. God, that's great. Uh, Fabulous. Today's the day. Awesome. And you got the, you got your colours colors there ready. So I'm guessing Lou's doing Valentine's, it's a Valentine's cards this Day. weekend. Yes. So there you go. Oh, oh, we're looking forward to seeing that one, Lou. Can't as wait. Well. Can't wait. Next up. Oh, and there we go. That's it. Wow. Thank you, everyone. Thank you so much. And Lou um, says she loves this card, Ricky. Oh, Justine says, but I send you all my love. 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 That's like a different card. That's an <laughs> all different thing, isn't it? I feel a bit of Scylla coming on there. I know it is. Love. Love. <laughs> love is in the air. Sabine says she loves moving mechanisms on yeah, cards. Yeah, they're good. They are good. They make them a little bit more special, I think. Yeah, they are, they are good. So, yeah, that's it. Thank you, everyone, for tuning in. Um, we'll just join, join us next week, really. Uh, join us Monday. We'll be back. So the theme for the weekend is... I won't put up the album yet, but I'll uh, I'll put it up on Monday. But start thinking about the cards you're going to do, which are to something personal to you. So show a little bit of yourself in those cards, then. Um, the card that you would love to receive, you know, your dream card you'd love to Write receive. Write this down tonight now, because you'll have forgotten by Monday. I'll rem- I will remember, <laughs> don't worry. <laughs> Next Friday, I usually like I do. <laughs> I, tr- I try and stay out of the album until the day. Yeah. Just so I get a surprise when I go through them. So, yeah, there we go. But you've made some amazing cards again this oh, week. Oh, this week, brilliant. And thoroughly again. enjoyed Always, thank you them. for joining us on the 100th show. Yeah. Um, you've been awesome, everyone. Thank you for enjoying 100 of them. Uh, have a great uh, weekend. Enjoy yourself. Stay safe and look after yourselves. And from us three, see you all soon. Bye.